With restrictions easing for daycares, more of them are looking into what it will take to reopen. There are 4,300 daycare facilities in the state of Georgia. Less than half of them are open right now. Latasha Givens has more on the different factors owners are having to weigh before they decide whether to bring children back. We've done everything that we can imagine to be prepared to reopen on Monday. Jerisha White's two Metro daycare centers have been closed for the last 45 days, but these empty hallways and classrooms will be filled with learning and laughter next week. Even though we're still in an uncertain state, you know, as a country as a whole, I still have to worry about the direct needs of the community that I service. Governor Kemp eased restrictions for daycares, but they still must follow strict guidelines. The deputy commissioner for child care services with Bright from the start says limiting exposure at daycare centers can be difficult. You can't put a bandaid on a knee. You can't change a diaper. You can't feed a baby from six feet away. It's impossible. Here are some of the new guidelines. No more than 20 people in a classroom. Community meals are banned and students must eat in their classrooms. Each teacher and child's temperature must be checked at the door and parents are not allowed in the building. We've implemented activities that cause for the children to have to be a little more farther apart than they normally would. White is planning art and reading projects with empty seats in between, individual PlayStations outside, and even personal sandboxes. Her goal is to only have 10 children in a room with five on each side. And White says about 40% of her student body plans to return to school on Monday, but about half of the child care facilities that report to the state will remain closed. Cheryl? Latasha, when you talked to the parents, did you get a sense? Are they more relieved that they now have a child care option or are they more concerned? Well, Cheryl, it's a little bit of both. Some parents I talked to say they simply don't have the choice because they have to work. But some parents did say it was a little soon. But the daycare owners I talked to say they're prepared to make any adjustments as needed and parents should not feel pressured just because they're open.